Are you absolutely sure the protocore fragment is here? <laughs> Guess I should thank it. It's not often I get a moment with someone as busy as yourself. Oh. So it's thanks to missions that Miss Hunter graces me with her presence. Mmm, that does suck. And these protocore weapons might keep you from enjoying Autumn's beauty. Shame. You found it already? The Association's mission system knows how to pick its hunters. It's part of my antique collection, sweetie. A treasure from the grassland. It's my most prized possession, even if it's only temporary. These patterns resemble the ones on the dagger. It's possible they're from the same tribe. I picked up some of your language from the grassland traders. I never thought I'd actually get to use it. You've come a long way. Are you also heading to Tala for the grassland festival? The wrestling match will be legendary. You made the right choice in coming here. The Khan has called for warriors from all the tribes. The champion will receive a sacred stone from him. It's a red gem. Daybreak is its name. They say it's capable of transporting you to a paradise. <sighs> yes, but you'll be competing against the bravest warriors from the grassland. Aren't you scared? Participation is what matters in the end. Great! I'll go tell the Elder then. Ah, since we're going to the same place, why don't you join us? It's always nice to have company. You sure that sacred stone is the protocor fragment? Let's not think about the competition for now, sweetie. We have more important things to do. Admiring the scenery.
They were complimenting Silas. He didn't look like a foreigner while riding a horse. I told them he'd be participating in the wrestling match, too. They'll cheer for him. Once he enters the competition, a few girls might hand over their pouches to him. It's a custom here. If a girl fancies a warrior, she gives him a pouch she made at the celebration. Sert is my beloved, and he's a warrior from the Sud tribe. I made this for him. Miss Tarna, what's the word you use around here to refer to your beloved? Did you get that? Well, I did. Maybe I'll repeat it a few more times so it will stick in your head. Here on the grassland, when someone catches your eye, you confess to them. You can't hold back. What if someone else claims them first? Whoever takes them, keeps them. I agree. How would anyone know otherwise? I believe sincerity is not having to beat around the bush or play any games. You're not wrong. The air here is refreshing, and the people are honest. And you look good in those clothes. Very cute. What? Isn't saying what's on your mind important when it comes to sincerity? I'm going to turn in for the night. We'll be moving at the crack of dawn. We rarely have guests when we travel, so there aren't enough yurts. You might have to share. Given what we've been through before, sharing a room shouldn't be a problem, right? Oh. So you're just anxious about the competition, sweetie? You do know my wounds heal quickly, right? <laughs> Sincerity really is the best. Let's see who ends up being the blanket thief. Someone's being sneaky. She's taking the blanket with every toss and turn. No. Oh. Guess I have to blame the blanket for barely covering half my body. I wasn't lying. It's exactly one half. Why are you still moving? <sighs> I wonder exactly who's restless here. Keep it. I'll be fine. Making the most out of the limited space we have.
Still awake, sweetie. You seemed calm during the day. Then we keep searching for it. What about the other times? <sighs> the situation isn't dire. That might be why I'm relaxed. Actions do speak louder than words, and more sincere. Perhaps we can learn from each other. Think about it. Maybe people have fewer things to worry about when in an unfamiliar place. That's even more of a reason to cherish the time we have before the competition. <laughs> Are you interested in making one yourself? It's not that hard. Think of it as a way to pass the time. There are a lot of colors to choose from. White, black. You people have interesting tastes. There's a riding competition. Silas is participating in it. I heard Silas beat Tamor in archery today. Tamor is last year's champion. Tamor demanded a rematch on horseback. Surprisingly, Silas said anyone could join. I was able to get a feel for the warrior's skills. I should know my enemy. Now you don't need to worry about me losing anymore, right? They're still human, and humanity isn't unbeatable. Who are you talking about? <laughs> well then, what an unexpected twist. I've been competing since this morning. If I'm doing another round, the prize better be worth it. If you lose, you need to shout out the word Tarna taught us. In that case... I'll say it out loud three times. You're saying that as if I'm destined to lose. Whoa. Seeing you go all out made me wonder if you were scared of the punishment. Or just really thirsty. Your dedication is always admirable. Is that something I shouldn't see? We're 
Will I be able to catch a glimpse of it before we leave? You were so determined to win. Even your hair got some action. Let me help. The girls in the tribe have unique braids. I should give you one. Did I say I stared at them? I was looking at their hair. Was I too rough? On the grassland, people wear head coverings because their hair is precious to them. Only the individuals they're closest to get to see their hair in its natural state. I like your hair. I can adapt to any location and call it home. As long as I'm willing. But now I have a condition. If you're not there, then I'm not interested. Ta-da, my magnum opus. I only glanced at the other girls' braids. I can't recall all the minutia. Once I hone my hairstyling skills here, I'll return to Lincoln and try again. What do you think? <laughs> Let's not do that, sweetie. You wouldn't make me braid other people's hair, right? The horses are done drinking. We should regroup with everyone else. What's on your mind? I never go back on my word. Shivanika, Shivanika, Shivanika. like both of us have a knack for pushing limits. Drink too much and you'll get tipsy. The Elder. The most revered person in the tribe noticed me eyeing it. He figured I could use it. Competing all day still hasn't put you at ease, I see. So, what's our next course of action if I lose? Are you going to abandon me, or...? Are we embracing a nomadic lifestyle of riding horses and herding sheep? Only a 
if you're with me. <laughs> then I won't lose. Warriors from across the grasslands have gathered. Today's competition will be fierce. Kael tribe worships the bird god. Would you like to pray for Silas's success? If I lost, I'd be stuck here forever. Could I really lose? What do we have here? A secret reward for the champion? Let me take a good look at it. The Elder spoke of this. A girl gives it as a present to her beloved. Do you have a lover? I can't return it then. On the grassland, whoever takes it, keeps it. If someone handed the champion a pouch, should he take it? <laughs> or we can face it together. Didn't you say sincerity was important? Actions speak louder than words. <laughs> I need to show them I already have a lover. And since she won't take me away, I'll just have to take her myself. said strength is the most revered quality on the grassland, regardless of your origins or bloodline. You are one of our warriors now. May you be like the name of this sacred stone, the first light to appear after a long night.
will be the first thing you do once we're back. see why we can't. Unless it's intentional, people won't easily forget what they learned. See you in a bit, sweetie. Already want to go back to the grassland? Sweetie, what makes you think I wanted to spend my life wrangling sheep? I told you, I'm not interested in adapting to a place if you're not there. And so, we meet again. Here's the protocore fragment. Go ahead, take it. What's the matter? We want to see each other. I already have your most prized possession. However, we did agree to learn from each other when we were in the grassland. It's my turn now. Imagine red autumn leaves and the scent of roasted chestnuts. Do you want to visit the park now? Should we postpone our outing? <sighs> then let's go, kitten. <laughs> 